Moral quarrel. All right. The first step is we answer all the cards in front of us. We must answer honestly or the game won't work. Okay. I feel like I'm getting tricked into something I don't Magical want to. Magical genie offers you one of two very specific wishes. A, you can live one life that lasts 1,000 years. Or B, you can live 10 lives that last 100 years. Which do you choose? Ooh. 10 lives at 100 years would be a different experience every time, whilst one life it. might it's suck. Easy part. You are a royal guard on the lookout for I'll a take the hundred years. sorcerer that has been terrorizing villagers. When you finally apprehend this sorcerer, you discover he is Charles, your childhood best friend. Do you A, tell Charles to leave town and never return? Or B, throw your friend in the castle dungeon? I'd say leave town and never return. Would you rather A, have a pet dragon, or B, be a dragon? I want to be a dragon with a pet dragon. That would be awesome. That's weird. A pet dragon, though. Would you rather A, have a tail that never stops loudly tapping against the ground, or B, have noodles for hands? Well, that wouldn't allow you to pick up anything. Dragons have tails. So tail. Those are hands. Always tapping the ground. Do you ground. still need more time? Yeah. We went with such a simple game. That one's uh. Would you rather a constantly take the tail syrup and not smell it, or b constantly smell reeking syrup? I Ooh. actually like the smell of syrup. Yeah. I don't know. I wouldn't want to reek though. No one would want to be around you, so I guess I'd rather smell it all the time. At the start of our turn, we choose which player we want to try to pair with. We'll then ask the question from the card at the top of our decks. If both Asker and Aski answer the same way, they both place the card on one of the three spaces between them. Once there are three cards between the two players, they both win the game. If there's not a match between players, the card must be discarded. If a player runs out of cards before matching three, they lose. Hmm. Graham, are you getting all this? I think so. I'm building a match between you two. Which one is it? Is it me? Is it Nice? Do they like me? Do I like them? Where's my exactly. Friend? Oh, lavender and oh, eggs. We're inside. Should I take my hat off? What if they don't like capes? That's silly. Everyone loves capes. What if they're allergic to triumph? Please tell me this is my inside voice. What are you thinking about? Yes, it is okay. Oh, good. Just in my relaxed box. Yeah, I was gonna Ready say. To begin? Graham, you start. A magical genie offers you one of two very specific wishes. A, you can live one life that lasts 1,000 years. Or B, you can live 10 lives that last 100 years. Which do you choose? All right. Uh... One hundred lives. Hmm, let's see here. A. I don't agree. Think Dang. of all the lives you could lead with ten chances. Explore, exactly. Artist, pirate, vampire. Or a ninja, or a zombie. Yes. Graham. A rich merchant inadvertently drops one shiny gold coin on the ground. You see a poor, hungry orphan pick it up. Do you? A, convince the orphan to be honest and return the coin, or B, turn your head the other way and let the orphan keep the coin. Turn my head. B, the orphan needs that money more than the merchant does. Hmm, I chose A. I figured that honesty would be rewarded with more than just one shiny gold coin. That's possible. Graham? You have been hunting for your starving family all day and only managed to catch a small goose. On your way back home, a hungry beggar offers you magic beans in return for the goose. The beggar tells you that the beanstalk sprouted from his beans will lead you to a chest that produces unlimited food. He would go after it himself, but his legs are too tired and old. Sounds like a load of shit, but sounds like something she would go with. Kindly reject the offer and bring your starving family their dinner. That's a guarantee. Let the beggar eat the goose and plant the beans in your yard. 
I would take A. You gotta feed your family. A? I wouldn't give up a bird in my hand for a wild goose chase. She would, though. Three. B. Magic bean! Yes, I get it. I need to go with the most logical answer. I will connect you with you. You are a royal guard on the lookout for an evil sorcerer that has been terrorizing villagers. When you finally apprehend this sorcerer, you discover he is Charles, your childhood best friend. Do you A, tell Charles to leave town and never return, or B, throw your friend in the castle dungeon? And I'll let her answer. I pick A. I agree. Yes. Charles should be banished for the crimes he committed. But I couldn't imprison a friend. Niece? It says, you are the kingdom's wizard doctor. In the middle of the night, an honorable knight and despicable thief arrive at your door. The thief's injuries are much more severe than the knight's. Do you A, heal the knight first, or B, heal the thief first? I picked A. The honorable knight served our kingdom well, and he deserves to be healed. I picked B. I would honor my medical oath to serve those in need first. Mm-hmm. She uses logic and intelligence, and that's actually something I am heavily into. She's about to start winning my, my questions. Oh. Based on that. Pretty on the nose. A man you've never met, but is known as a friendly king, sends for your hand in marriage. Do you A, accept his invitation, trusting his reputation, or B, seek love on your own? Is there any other answer than B? Of course. I chose the same. <laughs> Would you rather A, have a pet dragon, or B, be a dragon? I feel like pet dragon because she would logic. A, definitely. Thank a. you. Yep, I could use a pet dragon. Our moat monster is looking to retire. That was a hard one to Brad. understand whether she'd take that. All right, You're so she's gonna take the logical and answer. Thief pickpockets your Poor. only coin. Takes my only coin. You to go hungry for the night. Go hungry for the night. A few days later, you see the same thief get robbed of his dinner by two bandits. You chase after the bandits and get back the stolen food. Do you a return the food to the thief? Or B, keep the food, teaching the thief a lesson. Oof, man, that's a tough one. It's going to be hard to get her after all. What would she do with this? The honest thing to do is to do is to give it back to him, no matter what he did to you. But if I keep the food, I, that feels like the... I'm going with A. I would return the food to him. I'd return the food. Hopefully a good example would turn the thief around. Oh. Actually, I'd eat the food. You said I was poor and hungry, right? That thief will be fine for one night without dinner. Hopefully he won't steal again. Oh well. Not quite getting caught up. We're one to one with everybody here. Gram? I can Your best friend damn near intentionally not answer them. The love of their life on the day of the wedding. You discover that their fiancé is a gremlin, using a magic spell to disguise themselves as a human. The gremlin assures you it loves your friend and begs you to keep their secret. Do you A, tell your friend anyway, or B, keep their secret? Best friend's plan to marry the love of your life. Love of your life. Sure, their fiancé is a gremlin. Okay, magic spell, disguise spells. Your ministers loves your friend. Oh, I would have to tell my friend. A, if they're truly in love, it shouldn't matter. No, B, I wouldn't want to ruin their special day. True love shouldn't matter. I get you. We don't quite get along, all of us. Would you rather A, have a tail that never stops loudly tapping against the ground, or B, have noodles for hands? Well, that wouldn't allow you to pick up anything. What do you say? B. Damn. But actually, I picked A. I need these hands for adventuring. Graham. She just doesn't like that lady. Love as the royal love doctor. But during an appointment, your best friend's husband admits to you that he's in love with another woman. Do you A, break the confidentiality policy and tell your friend, potentially getting fired, or B, advise the man to go back to his wife, 
and hope your friend does not find out that you knew he had eyes for another. Oh, oh man. Great confidentiality, that's a... Uh... Why is a man to go back to his wife? If your friend does not find out. Good eyes. Gosh. I'd have to. The B. If he's coming to me for help, he deserves to be forgiven. Actually, I pay ah, you son of a bitch. To be told. Really? You're hard to follow. You're hard to read. These two girls are definitely harder to read than I was expected. V. They're not even asking me questions half the time now. Are the only important qualities for a hero to have. A. True or B. False. False. B. B. False. For certain. A good leader is well rounded. Exactly. Great minds think alike. They're going to connect Would before you I do. A. Constantly reek of syrup and not smell it. Or B. Constantly smell reeking syrup. Is there any question? A. Ah! Actually, I Every answer I had would have probably been for her better. Be able to go out in public if I smelled like that. I lost the game, but was happy to see the bond that Nice and V shared. Mm. Oh well. I have a small connection with the both of them. When the sun went down, the air turned frigid. We decided it was too cold to play another game and headed to bed. The walls of the tower were pretty thin. Embarrassing as it is to admit, that night I overheard the princesses talking about me. So, what do you think of King Grand the Wise? I'm not sure about him yet. What do you think? He's interesting. This seemed like the perfect time to explore the tower. I was interested in getting to know my new home better. Also, these girls. Well, I'm going to stop here. That was longer than I expected it to be, just kind of bit, but because uh, I didn't expect that uh, game to run as long as it did, and I expected to actually do well at it. Uh, it turns out I don't know anything about either of these girls as well as I thought, so time to explore, as he says. In the next one, we're going to explore this place a little bit more and hopefully get a better idea of who's who. I I'm going to be surprised who I end up with, I have to be honest on this, because uh, I would think logically, like I said, uh, Nice would make sense, but V is enticing, so we'll see how this goes. If you guys are interested in seeing it, then I'll see y'all in the next one. Have a great day. Hey, fellow Asians, don't forget to like and subscribe by clicking the button in the center of the screen. You can also find the last video by clicking the button to the left, and you can take a look at some of the other stuff I've done by clicking the button to the right. Hope you enjoyed the video, and have a good day.